All right, I'm going to show you how to play The Day I Met You by Lillian Axe. Just a really, really beautiful, beautiful song. And um, I need to tell you about the tuning first. I'm, in, I'm tuned down a whole step. And um, if you don't know how to tune down a whole step, um, what you do is if you're in standard tuning, just tune your low E to your D string, and, um, which is called drop D. And, and then from there, you would tune all the following strings to your low E string. So you, tune, you just tune them all the way down. And then from there, you're a whole step down. And um, this is the way I keep my guitar tuned. And um, if you try to play along, um, it won't sound right if you're not in that tuning. So uh, anyway, there's a lot of videos out there, people playing The Day I Met You. But there's not a lot of, uh, I didn't see anything as far as instruction goes. So I'm just going to break this down and um, show you how to play it if you've tried to figure it out and couldn't. It took me a while to figure it out. But um, anyway, it's in G. And you're going to start out with a kind of a G on the D string on the fifth fret. And then put your pinky, um, your pointer finger on the B string third fret. You're gonna leave that uh, G string open. It's gonna sound like that. So the main, I'm just gonna play the main part of it for you, then I'll show you how to do it. I'll try to get where you can see a little better. So uh, ring finger, fifth fret, pointer finger, second fret, B string. You don't want to hit any of the other strings. They'll kind of clash it. Like if you hit, they just kind of clash. So you want to stay on those three. Find you a picking pattern like that. From there, fourth fret. D string. And then second fret, D string. While still holding that B string at the third. Then back to the fourth. So in context, it would be. Do you remember? So that's an open D right there. That's how it would end. Do you remember? To a C chord. When our lives D were so complete back to that funny uh, G long cold December see so bittersweet D now you're gonna go to an E minor the way uh, the way he plays it on, on the record and instead of playing it here he plays it at nine minor power chord so it would be but if I could be my set aside one day see that I could hold you forever and I think this is called an E9 I think I would say to see the day that I de met you back to that G So it would be, but if I could set aside one day that I could hold forever, I would say the day that I met you. And then it goes back. 
to it. Is it still magic? See, although we've grown worlds apart, back to the G, it seems so tragic. See, so frail the heart. Back to that E minor up here. But if I was blessed with just one wish to take me through my lonely life, I'd wish to go back to the day that I met. End on that G. And from here it goes to an A minor. down to the E9, C, so it be. And when you feel you're on your own, well just believe you're not alone, and you feel the that we shared years ago Don't be blue That's pretty much the whole song It's cold in here this morning so my guitar is going out of tune a little bit but um, that's that's basically it. It's simple, but man, it's really beautiful. Beautiful uh, chords, beautiful structure, uh, a beautiful song. So um, if you ever wanted to learn how to play that one, that's that's how you play it. So um, if you have any questions, comments, leave them to me. I appreciate your time. Enjoy.